Hey, that old tape that surfaced that we all know that's old when you oh, were talking, talking about, about doing, uh, the, raping. Uh, yeah, raping the white woman. Yeah, y'all. Now that was an Asian woman I was talking about. <clears throat> yeah, that was an Asian woman I was talking about, and I was fucking with the Asian people. Yeah, I was really. Uh, I had just prior to that video, to that segment of the video, I was really talking about the rappers, money bag, yo. Uh, and so I painted a scenario, nigga. I'm the first nigga to come to the internet bragging by killing white folks and raping white bitches. So yeah, that was part of the persona in the character. A big dick shit talking nigga like Nat Turner and them. Nat Turner and Willis them raped. Tupac raped. Biggie talked about raping. LL Cool J, uh, Mace, uh, nigga Kobe Bryant called him a rape. Mike Tyson called him a rape. She and Lawrence Taylor caught him a rape. Lawrence Taylor got caught with the 16-year-old little hoe with the yeah. black eye. The pimp dropped the bitch out with the black eye. He still fuck on the bitch. All these niggas, we love rape. Nigga with Harvey Weinstein was with Jay-Z with the rape. Man, President Trump said, I didn't walk up to him and grab their pussy. So when I heard that, I said, man, I can say whatever. I ain't nigga, I can say whatever. And I ain't never done it, so I can say I done it. Yeah, yeah, no, nah, man, that's shocking. Ah, and I want to be a badass nigga uh, uh, who can get online and say some shit that most niggas is afraid to say. Nigga, I'll rape a white hoe. What? What the fuck? <laughs> Better scare the shit out of nigga. Because, man, niggas won't say no shit like that, huh? So I want to be bold and cold all at the same time, homie, and do like the rapper. The rapper say whatever. Why I can't? Yeah. Yeah, and the shit they say they don't do. Yeah. So I'm doing the same thing. I wanted to show the hypocrisy of this, my nigga. Thanks. That's all I want to do. So that's why I'm saying some of the most outlandish, most shocking shit, homie. I studied this method. And it's working. It's working, homie. It's nigga, I got some of the biggest platforms in the world, nigga. But when I was talking in Dolph neighborhood at that elementary school, nigga, they ain't show that one time. Nigga, I gave them over a thousand dollars in that school for Christmas. One mother. One little boy, he told Mr. Wallace, he said, Mr. Wallace, can you can you walk out to the car with me? Cause my mama won't, she ain't gonna believe me. And so he walked out to her and, and he he showed how much money he had, the mama started crying. That we need some bills to be paid. Nigga, I don't know that. I'm just in that bullshit. I'm fucking with the babies. But nigga, my foundation is strong. I got the people. Nah, I'm the real live people's champ, homie. Uh, and I talk like the people. I wear their clothes. I, I get on their live. I get them get on my live. Man, boosting them don't do none of that, homie. Uh, and then I bless all the people, homie, who ain't got big platform. Uh, I can't lose. You know, I can't lose. Uh, I can't even crash out at this point. Yeah, I can't even crash out at this point, homie. Uh, Cause this is predestined. Uh, no, no, this is this is this is this is my destiny uh, to do this uh, and to be where I'm at. So you do you think that video resurfaced? It was part of a smear campaign, like Ti and them trying to put it back out. Yeah, I I, I I know it is, but nigga, that that video surfaced every ninety days. <laughs> yeah, it does. <does. laughs> yeah, that video surfaced every ninety days. Then if you look at it, nigga, my dress was down to my shoulders. Nigga, I was wearing my dress in a ponytail. Nigga, my dress was down to my shoulders. So yeah, now nah, that video surface, uh, uh, that's one of my best videos. I love it. I ain't bullshit. I love it. Uh, because where in America can you find a black man, homie, that even bold enough to say that? Homie, don't you know, nigga, some white folks talk about raping black folk and don't give a damn about their mamas and ain't them think of how horrific it is? See, I like to project to not just America and black people, but to everybody, homie. The, the harsh reality of what black people had to endure before we had it good. We got it good. No, 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 nigga. Uh, 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 there was a faction of the Black Panther Party. That's all they did was rape white women. Uh, there was a time in America, homie, uh, in Fort Worth, Texas, to be exact, they had a group of niggas that broke into white folks' houses, nigga, and raped white women. They were called the Pollywood Rapists, the Polly Rapists. They sent terror through America, the idea of a nigga go force his dick into a white woman. Nigga, that, I'm psychologically doing some shit. <laughs> niggas just don't know it, but niggas are in their feelings. And I'm saying to white bitches, when rape is rape, nigga, who, what the fuck you give a fuck a white woman got raped? 
You said you heard it, nigga? Yeah. Look at you, nigga, music videos. I think about, it ain't nothing but a G thing, baby. That video, the sister at the party, dress nice. What them niggas do, homie? They got this nasty ass bro. <laughs> <laughs> The baby, homie, what he do with that champagne, homie? They drowning them bitches. <laughs> <laughs> the bitch got to spit that shit up. Homie, them niggas is spinning with it. Them niggas demean women. Now, all of a sudden, niggas just picking on you, niggas. Just fucking with you, nigga. We call it high side where I'm from. In the game of high side, nigga talk about your mama, your sister, your baby. Oh, that ain't your baby, nigga. That look like Leroy. That's Leroy. Just, just, no, nigga. All that's in fair game, nigga. In verbal judo. When did niggas start dying because I hurt, because your feelings got hurt? When did niggas, when did men start killing each other because their feelings were hurt? That's what this shit is, nigga. I'm hurting these niggas' feelings. So, now nah, I don't give a fuck about that video. Nigga, that video was strategically made, and it's doing what it's doing. It'll forever keep the relevance of talking. And so what I know is, I took a, see, I'm too smart for niggas. I hate I'm giving up all my goddamn information. But now, nah, nigga, I took a motherfucking me, uh, cycle of violence class at Texas Wesleyan University. Uh, man, it breaks this shit down. America promotes violence. America promote rape. When you look at hip-hop music, hip-hop music promotes rape. When you look at shit like Fifty Shades of Grey, nigga, that shit that promotes rape. Uh, we have a culture of rape. We have a culture of violence that we ignore and try to pretend like it's not there. But nigga, everything in America has to do with a woman's sex. So our children are raised in a sexual culture. At what age do they start being responsibly having sex? Most young, most girls are getting raped, huh? When they virginity's lost. Cause the nigga don't know how to ass to get. And she don't know how to make her nose be firm. So, it's either by force or by coercion. Rap teaches you to coerce girls. That's rape. Coercion is rape. Say, what you drinking, baby? What you drinking? Say, 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 I, I wanna buy all them some drinks. You ain't buying them no drinks, nigga, just because you want them to feel good. You want to fuck. Because the drinking lowers the, yeah, nigga, she lowers guard. So, no, nah, it's, it's, it's coercion. So, I'm speaking more from intellect. I'm speaking more from a knowledgeable standpoint. I'm just not telling the dumb niggas my point of view where I'm speaking from. It's just sounding horrific to dumb people. But, nigga, believe me, as long as that video been surfing, uh, they'll find that victim. Yeah. You lying to me, nigga. They'll find a motherfucker somebody. He yeah, nah, homie. And 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 uh they would close the doors on me in high school. Uh when that video first surfaced, nigga, you know how many women in the Dallas Forward there that came to my defense? Nigga, they was on Clubhouse kicking black one hundred in my ass, nigga. Nigga, you know how many women came to my defense? Uh because in real life I'm a per I try to be a perfect gentleman. Yeah, 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 yeah. Especially with women and ladies. Now these bitches and hoes might say all kinds of things about me. What a woman and a lady. They go, oh, my boy, perfect gentleman. 